game. Hey guys. Back again to hear another story of immense fortune and unsinkable peril. The borderline. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora were told to contain mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people called them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, somewhat unsporting. <laughs> Operation Hyperia and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack, but forget the adventurers who risk it all for less uh, obvious rewards. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. Scratch that. 
our lives. It's hard to better. What are we? I was a little distracted. For? It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn. This is this a charity work? Was am I right? Concentrating I on the important things. What's the first thing you're gonna buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. If you're getting a fraction of what he earns, you'll be rolling in it. Being an exec in Hyperion comes with expectations. Yeah, I figure I could get lunch. Seems like a good place to start. Well, then we're starting with three of whatever's most expensive. Sure. And wine pairings. For lunch? We're gonna get twisted, bro. If I'm not puking up $500 in food and alcohol this afternoon, then we are doing it wrong. We're meeting with a vet afterward to celebrate. She booked us a table. Yep. Sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because you made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mine deal we put together. Hey, hey, we made it. Okay, we're in this together. If I'm moving up, we're all moving up. You can be certain of that. I appreciate that, Reese. You know, people around here have short memories when it comes to that stuff. You, me, Yvette, we're gonna run this place. Yes, we are. All right, man, let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right, yeah. Hmm. Oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back, uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. Perfect. Mr. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a second. No, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you now. Black is better. Look, don't concern yourself with why. Okay, Jerry. Concern yourself with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. Company car. Didn't even have to ask. You look surprised to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick. spaceship in the universe is shaped like a cock. It's destiny, race, And men, real men, men like me, make their own. And you could hold a grudge if you like. No harm, no foul, your thoughts are your own. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny. You don't want to be that man. Better. That really helps dramatically make my point. Oh, 
such as this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny and put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digestructed in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, yeah, cool, listen. I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh, Are you buying this vault key or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. Of course, I'm still interested. I guess I'm near a computer. Ten million. Yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. Assistant Vice Janitor. What? No, no, you, you, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report to Sewage Scout 23. Effective immediately. You better get an eye installed in the back of your head. Because you, you never know when my, I could be creeping up behind you. And Reese. Get used to that. This bitch punch. This is what I'm talking about when I say humility. That was lesson number two. Don't make lesson number three about a number two. What? Don't make me crap on the floor and make you clean it up. You're dismissed, Reese. I'll let you know when I need my trash can emptied. What the hell was that? He can't do this to us. He just did. No. No, no, this can't. 
can't be happening. I'm finished, Mom. I'm finished. You know who this place is. There's blood in the water, and everyone can smell it. No, 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 they can't. Not yet, unless you don't quiet down. We just gotta keep it on the down low until we figure something out. It's not that bad yet. <laughs> Sorry, you were saying something. I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? I thought you were getting a promotion. Trash duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. Henderson's dead. What? Are you sure? Yeah. I mean, you can ask him yourself. He's floating outside in space. It's that prick Vasquez. He threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to trash man. Holy crap. So, does that mean you're not buying? Well, just try to lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's gonna pay. Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type to... Can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. What? No way. We hit back. Poor Anderson. Yeah, he was a bastard, but he was our bastard, you know? There's no way Hyperion would let Vasquez do that to him unless there was a good reason. The vault key. I mean, that's... that's... What vault key? Vasquez has a deal set up on Pandora to buy one. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is, is vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Asquez, we have a friggin' vault key! What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Hold, please. Done. I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. I'm in accounting. I mean, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Cool. Well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed, whoa, all right? Oh, hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two. You know, things get dicey. Look, it's one thing stealing from a bunch what of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends. Friends to help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Come on, I'll buy you the lunch I owe you when we get back. Fine. But you're buying me lunch now and when you get back. <laughs> Done. We only got a couple hours. Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clear at the Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? I mean, you can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible or something? Sure, yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected, right? Look, it just... If you're gonna steal something, I uh, figure... No. No, don't worry. I've got a car in mind.
person. Oh, what'd you cross right there? Oh, crap. I think we... I think we killed it. Are we murderers now? We're, we're murderers. We're murderers. Great, great, we murder. You know, I, I thought it would take longer than 20 seconds before that happened. Relax, Vaughn. It's a skag. They breed like hostile rabbits down here. Still, it's kind of sad. Yeah. Kind of. It's uh, some sort of open a vault for Pandorans kind of deal. People love stuff when it's attached to a charity. They hardly ever question their intentions. So, this looks not good. Got ourselves a hero here! What are you looking at? It's Pandora. What did you expect? Yeah, no, I know. I, I guess I'm just now more acutely aware that I have $10 million to change to me is all. In a neighborhood, I might add, of back-planet nut jobs. Fine, don't be such a wuss. You know, when you say things like that, I sometimes forget you're pretending to be the guy who would say things like that. Wait, wait what? Okay, look. It's a boring, dusty old town. Nothing more, all right? Sure. Listen, one tap on the arm, and Yvette can send down a loader bot if things get too entertaining. That's true. And she gave me this. It is a stun baton. I do not know how it works, but it's definitely neat. Yeah, stick. Neato. God, I can't wait to be in that chair. You and me, Yvette. I mean, we bring this key back, and they're gonna make us the once and future kings of that place for sure. They'll send in a crew to use the key, and then that's it. Then it's kick back on the moon beach time. Yeah, yeah, we'll pop champagne and everything after we get back with the key. Ah, come on, it's in the bag. Trackers beep, beep, beeping, but I don't see the place. It's the world of curiosities, right? Yeah, do you see it? No. Could ask one of them. They seem normal-ish. What an excellent idea. I thought so myself. Some fellow, is he? We don't have all day here, Reese. Do you know where the world of curiosities is? Uh, it should be around here. You lost. Um... What are you here for? Look, guy, it's none of your business why we're here. Oh, you're a right kitten, aren't you? It's none of my business why you're driving your wagon through my town. You're Hyperion. You egg suckers ruined this town, you know that? Alice were bastards, but at least they had the good sense to fail. When Jack came in, he turned everything to smoke. Oh, my God. Who called in the ambulance, huh? Look, if you don't know where the world of curiosities is, stop wasting our time and just tell us so we can move on to the next hole of garbage that you people call a suburb and see if their morons know any better. You know, I thought today was going to be boring. Hey, little man. What's in the case? Hey, kitty cat, show us what's in the case.
<laughs> okay, now, look, before we get all bent, <laughs> oh. Is there like a convention or something? Oh. Bandits. You know what we got here? Reese, do we got a couple Hyperion warmongers, gentlemen. The bot. That primate. Already? Really? Just. <laughs>
first born, Loderbot. Well, you know, pro probably not, but... I... I can't believe we're alive. I mean, I... I never want to see somebody's brains come out of their nose. Not ever again. That... That was the single scariest experience of, of my entire life. <laughs> which should probably be over by now. But it's not. For some reason. But for those guys... A lot of those guys... Oh, come on. It was a little fun, right? You cannot honestly stand there and tell me that it didn't feel kind of great to kick all those guys' asses. <laughs> okay, yeah, it was a little awesome. But I'm sure it was as traumatic as it was fun. We're probably gonna need some therapy in the future, you know that, right? We'll be able to afford it. All right, let's just find this guy, August. Buy the key. Get the hell out of here. You were pressing that. Um, Ugh, does every animal on this planet have to look like a giant monster? was one thing, but this is taking a turn I really don't want it. Make its way to the world's famous hall of Pandoran luminaries. Come face to face with icons of the planet's turbulent history and hear how each met their grisly fate. Please watch your step and marvel at some of the unexpected ends of life's grand design. There's nowhere else to go. Come on, let's just get through it. Why do I fucking hear cursing that? Oh, come on, are you serious? 
serious. Well, this feels like we came in the back, so maybe there's a front door somewhere? Yeah, I don't know if we can get out there with the murderers all over the place. Maybe one of those bodies has a key or something and we just missed it. Wow, I mean, if we just randomly found the key, I mean, that would be amazing. You can be so careful sometimes, you asshole. No damn well there's a motherfucking person right here. What? What? How are you? Not great! Are you two not- Don't do that! Oh, okay, okay, I'm sorry! I didn't mean to scare you guys! <laughs> it, it just, it just happened, you know? Things happen, they happen! Is this part of the, like, some kind of ride or something? Since the moment we walked in, it's just been one big freaky puppet show, so I... Thanks! I'm Shade, and this I didn't mean to is my world of curiosity. Let me tell you right off the very bat, I am deeply sorry that you strapping young threshers of gentlemen here have to witness it in such sad disrepair. Time can take a toll, you know, and on more things than one. <laughs> but unfortunately, we are closed for renovations. But that doesn't mean you have to leave, of course. No! Listen, we're to make a deal, all right? We're buying a thing, something valuable. You know anything about that? I know a lot of things about a lot of things, and this thing in particular. <laughs> You're Hyperion, right? Here for August. Yeah, if you want to buy something strange and illegal, this is certainly the place to do it. came up with this place. He was a real thinker, you know, a real lover of animals. <laughs> Still is, actually, because he's definitely not dead. But the place itself... What happened? Uh, you get stuck in traffic? No. You Hyperion guys, you're usually so punctual. Getting 10 million together can't be too much trouble for you guys. Oh, well, excuse me. I, I don't know if you heard the explosions outside, but, you know, we had to mow down about a couple hundred bandits just so we could ring the goddamn doorbell. Just in time for the spring collection. <laughs> yeah, well, that's Pandora for you. If it ain't a friggin' bug stampede, some jerk-off is using you for rocket practice. All right, well, <laughs> I'll just leave you to your business things then. I'm August, but I figure you know that already. Is, uh, is Vasquez coming? I'm Vasquez, and there's nobody else coming. What the hell are you doing? What? You're not Vasquez. I know Hugo. I just talked to him a few hours ago. Yeah, no, 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 no. Hugo told us to tell you that we that he was Vasquez. <laughs> As a joke, you know? <laughs> because he is so, so obviously not him. <laughs> right? So, what's your name? Just so we're on uh, equal footing. You want my name? My name's $10 million for all you should care. You're a vault key to me, okay? That's it. Okay, okay, look. I don't know what the hell you think you're doing, but this is not how I operate, all right? I expected Vasquez, and I got you. Yeah! So let's all get friendly real fast. I mean, I'm trying. Aren't I trying? Huh? Aren't I trying? You're trying. So, let's try again. 
My name's August. What's yours? This is a... Do you want me to guess? You can pout all you want. You're not getting my name. Just sit down and let's do this so we can move on with our lives. Okay, so, let's see the money. Cash only for this deal. And I hope you brought big bills. Uh-uh, no, I know how this works. We see the merchandise first, then you see the money. Yeah. All right, all right, the baby wants its bottle. Fine. See anything so pretty in your miserable lives? This thing will practically dance in your wedding. It's state of the art alien crap. I'd use it myself, but you know, the monsters and all. It's goddamn gorgeous. Freaking A right it is. Okay, so the way I uh, usually do these things. Is... Wait! What? I I just don't like it. I got a I got a feeling. What feeling? Look! You said when I started to get a feeling about something that I should tell you and that we should walk away, right? What are you possibly feeling right now? We're almost done. We're good here. Everyone relax. We just want to buy the key from August and go. Yeah, he just wants to buy a key from me. Sasha, what the hell are you... I just... I just don't like it. They've had this dumb attitude on their dumb faces since the moment they walked in. What are you talking about? They... He pretended to be Vasquez, August. As a joke! <laughs> He's been a giant dick this entire time. And why... Why wouldn't they show you the money, huh? What's up with that? Sasha? I mean, look at that guy. Look at his face. What's wrong with his face? Hey, Sasha? Sasha, listen to me. I, I know you don't trust Hyperion. Yeah, you think? And I know you have zero reason to trust us, but I'm telling you, you're not like those assholes. In fact, we're trying to get back at one of the worst assholes up there, and we need that key to do it. So please, take the money, and let us screw over one of the biggest jerks on Hyperion. Please. So you're saying this key will get used to screw over some wretched Hyperion stooge? That's exactly what we're saying. All right, I'm sold. Awesome, let's do this. Well, just wait, just wait. Uh, August, everything's fine now. I mean, I don't know. If you really think... No, no, it's okay. The feeling's gone, August. Let's do the deal. Maybe today's not right for this. If, if, if things are weird, if you ha have a feeling about things. No. August, Bobby, come on now, a deal's a deal. We didn't come all the way down here. Just no, I'm, I'm sorry, guys, I was, I thought I was gonna deal with Vasquez, and now this, I just, I just think we should call it off until I, I think things are square. Maybe another time, fellas. Hun, we're here, we should just do this, really. No, I made up my mind. August, wait! Reese, this is your department. Do something! Yes. 
decided to show her face. I was just about to get to my favorite part. You know, where you come in and you ruin my life, you no-class scheming Pandoran scum! Oh, nice haircut, you lying Hyperion jackass. I love her. It is a nice haircut. Oh, shut up. Stop it, stop it. You're getting dirt in my eye. Oh, it sucks, because I'm trying to get it in your lying mouth. Oh, I <laughs> All right, all right. Mission accomplished! <laughs> and I'm not lying, okay? I'm embellishing. And how the hell was you know anyway? You weren't at the deal. Of course I was, you dope. I can't believe you still haven't figured that out. I knew you were dense the moment. Your turn, Fiona. My turn for what? Tell me your side of the deal. <laughs> you couldn't have asked me first? You kidnapped me hours ago. in the sun with Rax dive-bombing me for the last... Oh, no. Okay, I get it. This fraud conveniently left out the most important part of this whole thing. Which is... Oh, this ought to be good. No, yeah, go on. <laughs> I can't wait. It's, um... Well, it's complicated. It's mine! Give it! Stop! What's your freaking problem, man? important thing. Did you forget the part about it all being your fault? Come on, that was not my fault. He's so funny. Not all of it. Are you making a face under there? I can't tell what you're thinking if... <laughs> okay, fine. But let me start at the beginning. city cast in shadow known as Hollow Point. It's in a cave. Hmm. Anyway, for a long time it was just me and my sister. Just a couple of kids stealing what we could to survive. Until we met Felix. We tried to nab his wallet. Not only did he stop us, he showed us how to do it better. We've been working together ever since. This is taking too long. She's waiting. This latest scam was our biggest yet. The one that would set us up for life. That sounds familiar. What can I say? A lot of these stories start out the same way. Your fucking voice is familiar. Fiona, oh, relax. There's nothing to be nervous about. Felix. Raised you into a life of crime. Felix like cutie pie. Looks good. If August's offense worth his cut, he'll be selling it to some Hyperion stooge. It should be good enough to fool one of them. Not too many people have seen a Vault Key, real or otherwise. The paint may still be wet. Be sure not to let anyone touch it. There are only a couple spots to worry about, but it's best not to risk it. Keep them from touching it? <laughs> How do you expect me to do that? I don't know. But you'll think of something you always do. Hey, you're a pro. This is what you do. Your sister may have brought in the mark, but you're the one that'll close the deal by playing whatever role you need to to get the job done. If she introduces you as a tiny psycho, you'll squat down and scream about poop trains. Okay? That first introduction is who you are. You two have to work together. I have the shiniest meat bicycle. Exactly. <laughs> Showtime. Fiona, when she gives you your role, you play it as best you can. The deal came together much faster than I'm comfortable with, but it's worth the risk. 
so it's best to take precautions against the unforeseen. The purple skag is not the type of place you walk into without a backup plan. I don't like them either. Guns can be a crutch, but you should take it anyway. It's only for emergencies. One bullet. That's right. You'll always be able to talk your way out of more situations than you can shoot your way out of. Wet paint. No touch. Emergency only. I got it. Turned out we can move that the purple what? Ooh, I like it already. Oh, okay. I see you. Oh my phone is hot as fuck. Ooh, take money from the only fucking John. You get it all out. I guess. The voice sounds about fucking sounds familiar, man. Oh. Figures. <sighs> Good at look at repeating. Where art and culture flourish. That's the place. Yes. Oh, you look like that, um, that girl, um, that woman from Life Last of Us. Yes. She sounds a little bit like that. And like somebody else. Ouch, I'll be on. Great. Felix didn't mention anything about a bouncer. Sorry, no one's getting in here today, pretty lady. VIP's only. Private function. There's the Firestone Tavern down the road. If you really need a drink, they'll take care of you. Well, that's good, because I'm a VIP. What? Really? Yep. So if you could just get the door for Wait, me. Wait, one second. I don't know, miss. No offense, but you look pretty regular to me. VIPs are fancy folk. Anyway, I should have a list somewhere. Wait a second. That's you there. Your face is on that paper with that writing on it. What's that about, huh? What's them words say? And don't you lie and go taking advantage of me just because I ain't the strongest of readers. That's the VIP list, and I'm on it. They probably put a picture to make it easier on you. Well, that's a short list. I'm that important. Uh, I don't know. Out of the way, Tester. She's the VIP. Yeah, you know her. Oh, my God. Kids. Oh, that's her sister. Hey, Sasha, why didn't you tell me she was with you? So sorry, ma'am. Oh, Can't believe that worked. I can't either. Why is this a fucking secret? Oh my gosh. 